Hey everybody, and I am back, and today will be an updates video, as well as, no, I did not want to talk to you, as well as just a regular LP, and I will also be talking about some very important things, so, including why I've been gone the past week. When we last left off, I believe we beat Pelipper's attraction, which means we should be able to go talk to Carvana and Sharpedo and let them, or get them to let us build bridges. So, um, the reason I've been gone is because I have to get caught up on my schoolwork. As you know, I started a month and a half late, and my mom, my parents, say that I have to get caught up in schoolwork if, or by Thanksgiving if I want to do this really awesome thing in December. And it's a secret for now, but, um, well, it's not a secret to me, it's a secret to you. But yeah, that's why I've been gone, because I've been trying to get caught up on schoolwork, and I probably won't... Uh, my mic. Why? Why are you doing this to me? Um, I probably will not be back until the week before Thanksgiving. Um, so I'm currently on hiatus. Because... Oh, also, uh, no, I'm going to talk about this first. You succeeded in clearing Pelipper's attraction. You're not going to say that you can really fly, are you? Did your friends help you? No, I flew. Either way, you're pretty good. I keep my promises. You can build the bridge. I'll take. I'll talk to Gyarados myself. Carvana is now your friend. Sharpedo is now your friend. All right, so yeah. That's why I've been gone. I will continue to be gone, but I wanted to come on today and say Happy Halloween. Um, because I definitely wanted to make a part on ha Halloween. Um, Chow will not be coming today. That's something that's not happening today. It's just Poke Park. And I probably won't be uploading any videos for two weeks or so. I won't be like... I'm not going to record again until I'm on like a consistent stream, you know? I don't want to just like upload a video every one now and then. I want to like, you know, upload a video like consistently. So... This will be the last video until I can somehow work out the time to upload a part every day. And yeah, so I apologize for being gone, but... I will, er... And for not telling you, I did go to my grandma's, and I know whenever I go to my grandma's, it's... Like, I never come back. For whatever reason. So... I came back early this time, and then I'll be gone for a few more weeks. And then I should be back for good for at least a while. <sighs> wow, we've only been recording for three minutes. It felt like I've talked forever. So yeah, it's Halloween today, so happy Halloween to all of you. And today marks the end of the LP contest. Um, so yeah, all the votes have been in. Uh... <clears throat> I don't know why I'm, like, drawing a blank here. All of the votes are in. No more will be accepted. Anything after this day is done. Um. Yeah, so. Uh, the game that I will be LPing is a surprise. And I have the next three planned out now, so. Well, next, yeah. About the next three. I'm stuck on the third one on what to do. Because I like two games, but one of them I've never... Well, both of them I've never beaten, but, like, one of them I know what to do, and the second one it might be more difficult for me to understand what to do because I haven't played it in so long, and I can't, like, start another file on it. I don't have any more available files. Um, but, yeah, that's, like, months down the road, so I don't know why I'm going there right now. <clears throat> So yeah, I have the next three LPs planned out. They are all surprises, and no one will know until... They happen. <laughs> um, well, my friend knows what the second one's gonna be, because I'm doing it for her. It's a game I want to LP, so I didn't really care. She was just like, oh my gosh, I want to see an LP of this so bad, because I'm considering whether to get it. So, after this mystery LP, then I'll be doing an LP of that game. Um, and we have to talk to Gyarados. 
prison piece? Oh, that shiny thing? I have one somewhere, but what is it good for? Anyways, I have more important things to talk about. I'm the keeper of the beach zone now, and Polion should keep away. Eventually, I plan to defeat the Venus or Blaziken too. Then I'll roll the Poke Park. What do you think of that, eh? What? For Alligator asked you to stop me? That coward sent you. He's no match for me. What can someone like you do? That must be kind of some kind of joke. On the other hand, you do have many friends. You should be proud. You must be a good friend to have. But enough small talk. Mark my words. I shall be the next keeper of the Poke Park. Oh, you have a lot of friends. Hear me now. If you or any of your friends clear my attraction, I'll do this. I'll allow Empoleon to remain as the keeper of the beach zone. I'll also let you have that prison piece or whatever it is. How's that? Only if someone clears my attraction. Remember, you'll need ten berries to play Gyarados' Aqua Dash. Ready? No, I'm not ready. <clears throat> so, yeah. That was actually a lot of breath. That took a lot, okay? Um, don't worry, I'm not quitting. Don't worry. Um. <sighs> I'm just... It's like a water thing, so we have to, like, you know, go to the password again. So, let's see here. Zero, two, nine, seven... Zero, six... Two, six. <clears throat> Yay! Pikachu's surfboard. So now we're going back. <clears throat> oh, interesting story. Both of my brothers got pneumonia. It's interesting how I'm the only one who hasn't gotten it yet. <clears throat> Well, like, my parents don't have it, but here's how, like, the whole sickness thing works in my family now that I'm at home most of the time. My brothers come home, like, every other week, or practically every week with, like, a new illness. And then everyone gets better. And then somehow, magically, I get it. Oh, please don't make me repeat. Okay, there we go. I was like, don't you dare make me say that whole thing over again, or don't you dare even say it. Swim quickly along the water course. Beat the target time to reach your goal. As you begin swimming, hold 2 to increase your speed. Tilt the Wii Remote when you want to make a turn. When you go between flags, you'll get an instant speed boost. Avoid Carvana and Sharpedo. If you hit them, you'll slow down. Try for one last burst of speed when the end is in sight. Finish fast. Okay, so we're going to go with Pikachu. And I think all three members of the Piplup family can play this game. So we need to get it under 29 seconds, because I always try and get the bonus. Now, my strategy going into this attraction is just hold 2 and take really easy turns. But, like, take sharp turns, but make sure you're careful about it. And then also try and get every single flag you can. Um, I mean, I don't know if that's what was meant for this to happen, because they said, try for one last beast of spood at the er, beast of spood. What? I... No. Boost of speed at the end. I don't even know how I said that. Honestly, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. They said one last boost of speed at the end. So I don't know if you're supposed to hold two the whole time or not, but it works for me. Ha ha ha. I never thought you'd be able to clear it. I won't be bored anymore, not as long as you and your friends play my attraction. I don't need to become the boss of this zone. Here, take this. It's the prison pieces, I promised. I love how us having friends suddenly changes everything. It's like, I'm this big evil guy. Oh, you have a friend! Okay, I won't be evil anymore. It's really interesting, honestly. Okay. So... He'll quit. He doesn't want the beach zone anymore. Tell for alligator. He said so. So now we're going to be making friends for the most part. Would you like to save a record of your adventure? Yes, we would. Save complete. So now we're going to go to for alligator, and then this should be the end of the beach zone, if I remember. So we've already beaten two zones. Woo! Out of like five or six, maybe seven at the most. I don't know. I don't remember. If I, like, counted them out, I could do it in, like, ten seconds, but I'm too lazy to do that right now, and I'm gonna read. 
Okay, so now he's gonna break the rock. And this sequence is actually pretty cool. I like it. I've always been a fan of, like, for alligator. For whatever reason. I guess I just sort of, like, grew up with him in Pokemon Coliseum, because I think that was, like, my first Pokemon game. And, you know, he's on, like, the cover and all that. Um... Hip luck. Pikachu, that loud noise was cool. Oh my, for alligator brought the, ro the rock for you? Hmm, what is that? Hee <coughs> hee, I've never met you. That's a balloon, and you can fly it. It seems to be deflated and unusable, though. <coughs> Wonderful, something to fly. I'll take this balloon to the meeting place you talked about. Being able to fly would help us find Charmander and prison pieces. I'll try to fix it. I'll need somebody to help me carry it. Somebody sturdy. You're off to the iceberg zone, aren't you? Good luck to you. It's funny because, like, the way we find Charmander doesn't involve this balloon at all. So, you're sort of wrong there, Piplup. And I, like, see something over there. It's, like, gold on that island or something. That reminds me of, like, the Donkey Kong 64 game. Oh my gosh, I loved that game. I still have it. I should play the story sometime soon. I could never figure out how to beat it, though. I would always get to, like, Dixie, and I could, like, see Dixie in the cage, but I could never figure out how to get Dixie out of the cage. I was so bad at the game. My cousins were all like, oh, yeah, we know exactly what to do, and, like, got through my highest point in, like, an hour, and it took me, like, three days. <sighs> oh, well. So let's check where we are now. Okay, Venusaur's thir- no, Venusaur's 31, Piplup, okay, number 33 is Slowpoke. I've always loved the Slowpoke family, I mean, like, they're just hilarious. <laughs> you wanna play Chase, I love how Slowpoke has to play Chase. Oh, you Slowpoke, you. Nice job. Woo! I don't think anyone could, like, not beat Slowpoke, unless it was, like, Caterpie. Maybe Caterpie. Like, if Caterpie tried its hardest, maybe it could beat Slowpoke. I don't know, though. Mudkip has come to play! I forgot about that, Mudkip! Yay, I love Mudkip, he's cute. I like Torchic better, though. Torchic's my evolution. I mean, Mudkip, like, all the best to you. I like Mudkips. So I heard you mm. like Mudkips. I can't believe I just said that and me now. But, yeah, I like Mudkips. Mudkip. Yeah, Pokemons don't have plural there. Pokemons, oh my gosh. I've been playing this game since I was three, and I can't even, like, speak. No. Pokemon do not have plural names. It's like Chow. Multiple Chow is not Chows, it's Chow. Multiple Pokemon is not Pokemon, it's Pokemon. For example, a flock of Staravia. Not Staravias, it's just the single word. I don't know why it's that way, but it is that way, and it's like one of my biggest pet peeves when people cannot use that right. So now we have to play Chase with Azurul. Azurul's one of my favorite Pokemon ever, I just love Azurul. I like Azurul's whole family, I mean, I've always been attached to Meryl because of Tracy. The anime was my life when I was little. I haven't, like, watched it since the first season of Diamond and Pearl or something. Okay, I remember the exact episode I stopped watching on, I'm pretty sure. Totodile! Woo! I think pretty much the episode of Pokemon I stopped watching was when Staravia evolved into Staraptor at that um the tournament with like the ring. I don't remember what they're called. Um But yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the episode I stopped watching, because I remember having to watch it online. Because I was like, oh hey, well that's the only place I can watch it, so I found it online, and then I watched it. And then I don't remember anything after that. So, I think that was in the second season of Diamond and Pearl, actually, but I'm not quite sure. Um... Doo -doo 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 -doo. Who's next? Is we're all... Okay, oh, well, we're already friends with that one, are we? Yeah, we're already friends with Corsola. Okay. Why not Carvana Shapito? Oh, hey, that takes work off of us. Woo! Um, oh, no, I really don't... I don't want to make friends with him. Ew. Um, how many minutes were it? 14? Okay, I'll do that one, and then I'll be done. So it won't be like, you know, 
a really flipping long part. I like why not. He was in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. You give me like a Pokemon and I can tell you every game it's been in. It's creepy. It really is. Okay, so the tide must have turned. Lately, we've been seeing glass bottles on the beach. If you see any, would you put them in the recycling box? The recycling box is on the island where Gyarados is. <sighs> now, this always takes me forever to do. First of all, because you have to, like, carry the stuff like lumber. Second of all, because I always run out of bottles and can never find them. But, yeah, this part is actually pretty cool, like, if you think about it. You put in a bottle, and you get furniture to make the beach pretty. Hey, I'm on the table. Standing on the table, rebel. Yeah. I still haven't seen Pitch Perfect, and I want to go see it so badly. Oh, well. I'll see it eventually. Also, they have Totodile and for Alligator in this game, but they don't have Croconaw, and Croconaw is my favorite evolution of the Totodile family. So it's, like, really upsetting. Krabby has come to play. So, yeah, um, this is, like, a win-win-win situation, except for the walking, so just ignore that part. Um, let me think what I was trying to say. Okay. So you put bottles in, you get furniture, you become Wild Lord's friend, and more Pokemon come to be friends with you the more bottles you put in. So as you see, like, I cannot see any more bottles anywhere. I do not see them. Oh, there's one. Oh, a pink umbrella. <laughs> we just got a beach umbrella, though. We need variety, yo. I don't know where more bottles are. Um. I'm gonna have to, like, leave and come back. Um, what I want- Oh, I do want to check if there's more people there now. To give us upgrades. I do want to check that. Yes, I want to go to the meeting place. One thing that I don't like about this game is that you make friends with all these Pokemon, but some of them can't play attractions. Like Wailord, Carvana, Sharpedo, why not? None of them can play attractions. So it's like, if you're gonna make a game, like, just be able to make friends with people, you know what I mean? Oh, hey, there's Bee Barrel. So this raises our HP from 2 to 3. And then, again... Don't you think 350 berries sounds reasonable? Yeah, 350 berries sounds reasonable, but, like, the price gets higher every time you upgrade. So at the end, she's like, don't you think 1,500 berries seems reasonable for one HP point? It's like, no. I don't. All the others are just like, give me berries. And she's like, don't you think this sounds reasonable? And I'm like, uh, no. We paid 350 for an HP point today, why do we have to pay 1,500 for an HP point tomorrow? I don't get it. So now that we got that, I don't necessarily know when the last guy is going to be there. I think it should be, like, somewhere in the Iceberg Zone. Because I know he's in the Iceberg Zone. I know there's, like, one of them. There's his species there somewhere. It's not him for sure, because then, like, all of a sudden, random ones just appear in the meeting place. And they're like, oh, hey, I'll teach you this. Are there more bottles here now? There. Bottle. I have no clue how many bottles you have to pick up. I've, like, never kept track. This is three. No, this is four. I'm sorry. I think it's five or six. I'm not sure. <clears throat> oh, no, my splitters went out. <gasps> no, they went out for you guys, too? Are you serious? Okay, it's a hammock, if you can see it in, like, the left-hand corner. I really wanted you guys to, like, actually see that. Core fish has come to play. 
Okay, so I promise that, like, when I come back in a few weeks, I will, um... Have good splitters. Not necessarily good, just, like, new. You know, that aren't ripping. You've received a gift. It's a beach shelter. So, yeah. Um, I don't really see how that's a shelter, because it has no roof. So, after you get all the furniture, you just get berries every time you pick up a bottle. Because more bottles will spawn. Like, later in the game. Whenever you come back, it'll just be like, oh, hey, there's another bottle. If you decide to put them in the recycling thing, you get berries instead of new furniture. So, it's only ten berries, though. So, I've never, like, put it in. Yay! You've received a gift. Wow, plant pots to decorate with. So the triumphant music me uh, means you've done it. <clears throat> Thank you for helping with recycling. Okay. <laughs> Starly and Staravia flying at the same time past each other. Siblings! Wingle, no. You cannot talk to Waylord. I have to talk to Waylord. <laughs> Thank you for cleaning up the beach. You really have a good heart. I'd love to have a friend like you. Why, thank you, Waylord. So, we'll check if Waylord's our best friend, because I don't know what we have to do. Yeah, he's our best friend. So, next time when we come back, we'll be making friends with people, and... Yeah, I'll miss you guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in a few weeks when I'm all caught up. Bye.